In this video, I'm going to show you how fast and easy it is to test fuses using Devo. So let's get started. Now for this, we're going to be using the Devo Pro Kit, which comes with everything you need to test almost any circuit on any vehicle. I'm going to start with the 22-foot fuse test leads and also the red and black battery clamps. I'm then going to grab Devo, the standard meter probe, and we only need one of the five foot test leads. But the first step is to connect the 22 foot test lead to the battery. So the side with the fuse on it is the side that I'm going to connect closest to the battery. The red battery clamp is going to go on the positive post of the battery, and the black clamp is going to go onto the negative post of the battery. I'm going to then go ahead and connect the other side of my 22 foot test lead directly to Devo. On the left side, you'll see it says battery. We're going to connect black to black and red to red. As soon as I do that, Devo is going to go through its self check, and then Devo is ready to test. All right, now that I have my battery side connected to Devo and it's powered up, on the right side of Devo, it says circuit. And I'm gonna connect only to the positive port to the red circuit positive with my five foot test lead. The other end of my five foot test lead, I'm gonna connect my standard meter probe to it. I'm gonna go ahead and remove the fuse box cover. When testing fuses, you want to activate as many circuits as possible so you can test every fuse that has power to it. And to do that, I'm going to turn the ignition switch to the run position. All right, now that I've got everything connected to Devo, I can begin testing the fuses in the fuse box. And I will say that there are several fuses in here that do not power up because those circuits are off. So you get to see what a fuse without power looks like. And there is one fuse in here that is blown, so you can see what that looks like. Now, I haven't made any changes to the mode button of Devo. I've kept that exactly as is. That's the default when you first turn on Devo. And the only thing that I'm going to look at is in the corner of my eye, I'm going to look at the circuit positive LED, and I'm going to look to see what color that LED changes to. And that's it. I'm not looking at my other LEDs. I'm not looking at anything on the LCD itself. I'm just looking in the corner of my eye at that circuit positive LED. I'm gonna begin testing my fuse right here, and I can see that it goes green and green. That's a good fuse. Testing the next fuse, green and green. That fuse is also good. Moving on to my third fuse, green and green. That fuse is good. I'm gonna come up here, and you notice that it now it's red, and I'm gonna test the other side, and that's also red. This is a circuit that is currently off, this fuse doesn't have any power to it, and that's why we have red on both sides. I'm going to test the next fuse, red and red. Again, there's no power on that circuit. I get green and green. That fuse is good. Do a visual inspection of these fuses, and those all look good. Make my way over here. I get red and red, so that circuit is also off. Red and red, that circuit is off. Green and green, that circuit is good. That fuse is good. Green and red. There's my blown fuse. And I know that because I have green on one side and red on the other. So I have one blown fuse and it's that one right there. Green and green, that fuse is good. Green and green, that fuse is also good. And you can see as I do this just how quick and easy it is just to look out of the corner of my eye and I can see whenever I get green and green on both sides, the fuse is good. If I get red and red, that means that that circuit is not currently on. And if I get a green and a red, that indicates that the fuse is blown. And just like that, within seconds, you can test every fuse in the fuse box.